You're not supposed to drink alcohol till you can't walk. That's, that's stupid, bro. And uh, like whether that's you're young dumb. or old, you shouldn't be drinking alcohol like, to that point. Yes, you can't live and say, I can't wait tomorrow so I can get drunk till I'm dead. Mm. Like, till I drop. That's stupid. Or, or I want to get lit. Like, that's stupid. Oh, I'm I wanna sorry. Get I wanna get lit. Like, lit. you can, no, you can get lit, man. But nah. But, you, know, you can get lit. The thing is, no, no, no. The thing is, I agree, now. Nah. But when people say, I want to use lead, they're not using it the way we use it. The way we're using it. They're using it. Oh, they, they, I want to get finished. I want to get finished. Finish. Go on. That's the thing, bro. And yeah, I don't yeah. think, I think that's why they put an age, an age limit to alcohol, like 18, 21, whatever it is. Yo, what's up, guys? Boys Allowed. Season two, <laughs> episode, episode two. two. And I was yeah, like, back, back, bro, yeah. uh, back and better. Um, you know what I'm saying? Don't forget, we drop every second Thursday. And make sure you watch these videos when they premiere live. Um, but we like, they'll always be here, but you know, it's just. And um, if you're lucky, you might get a mess um, and talk to us directly. If directly you're on the premiere. live, exactly. If you're yeah. lucky. Because we actually yeah. respond. Yeah. 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 Mean, we'll so. start responding. Uh, <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, we'll try yeah, our man. best. Um, don't against. forget though, you know what I'm saying? You see, I got on the, the merch. Boys a lot, merch, boys a lot. The members only t shirts. Mm. Polisha, Polisha, you know what I'm saying? Well. Um, yeah. And yeah, bro, we back. We back. And yeah. Gonna be more consistent. But, anyways. Yeah. How oh, we're actually, we are consistent. Um, yeah, we are we consistent. We post every two weeks. That's consistent, bro. Stop. And we post yeah. like three times plus in a week. Like yeah, in a in week. week. So, uh, yeah. We are and if we have like how many episodes like so many uh so we have a whole 18. of season one if you're catching us in season two um go watch season Nine one bro because that's like where we started you know so yeah anyways yeah. boys how was your december i remember mean, december was, it was fine bro it was fine it was chill <clears throat> yeah was, like, pretty mid respectfully i just did the one i normally do every other holiday that's why uh, the hype for december is gone mm. growing up there was a lot of hype hey, you look forward to december but now it's gone there's no yeah. christmas spread or i don't know for me there wasn't christmas for this year not saying anything bad happened i just didn't mm. feel it but mm. besides that i can't argue too much i don't think december because every december now it's like as the year progresses bro there's new problems as in um yeah. this groove thing is getting out of hand yeah. um the age limit yeah. for groove is decreasing you know what i'm saying 13 year olds 14 year olds can start grooving now yeah. i'm saying um substance abuse and all of these stuff each year i'm sorry in december it just goes i mean yeah. last year in december there's a, a whole lot of stuff that mm. we're gonna dive deep into this episode mm. yeah. but also like with that you know nah, you can just, just, nah. nah um with this whole december thing bro like the that whole like Five. people yeah, yeah people just can't wait yeah. for it because like it's, it's only a south african thing if you know it's like yo, wait, i think I it's like a global yeah. thing man but, but in it, essay yo, like, it's like there used to be a point where like there's no people like yeah. south africans are happy to be in december to be in december yeah, yeah. They, yeah. they look forward to it when it's the 30th of november they're like yo it's the same it's like mm. yeah you know but but for me the hype is gone because like you know as you're saying now you used to look at it from january but like you know what i'm gonna study I can't wait, I can't wait. so i can't wait so, so december i feel like i'm gonna go <clears throat> out but the thing is the things you do in december you can do it early in the year like mm. just every other holiday if you think about it because mm. in my opinion the significance of december is gone um uh, maybe because i'm old enough i, now, think, I think so yeah. like that december thing is gone as you get older because like christmas doesn't feel the same bro like mm. christmas eve like that excitement is excitement. gone Dude. like i don't know maybe i don't know if it's a thing of like we don't get presents we have to buy our own presents or, or no like christmas, christmas of father christmas is not even a person like, <laughs> yeah. i think yeah, you know, not even is we don't even like, buy the easter eggs, eggs. any no easter eggs are for, <laughs> yeah, for easter it's but easter. sometimes you buy yeah, them like, christmas you buy, you buy like your or you know those choice assorted box bro what happened oh, like, the, i we I, gone. I, those don't have significance anymore but i remember bro Ah, uh, they used to be these oh, biscuits you, are for December. These clothes these for biscuits, Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, those these, like, like, hey, these clothes for Christmas. These clothes are for Christmas. The shoes, like, everything. Yo, Christmas. And then you bro, can't wait. You just though. can't wait to wear it. And then you watch those Christmas movies. That's when I used to watch. Yeah. That was like uh, of a train. This yeah. white guy goes oh. on a train and like it's it was, bro, was like it was just the best. What is it called? Movie. The Express what? Was? Yeah, the yeah. Whole Express. Whole Express. Express. And then you watch Home If you know Alone, it's hey, if you know that movie, but you Home Alone one and two, you know all of those bro, Christmas, all those nice Christmas, Christmas, Christmas movies. movies. And now it's like center. it's not the same, bro. Now it's like, bro, there's no because I think it's because you're full of so much bad news, bro. I mean, mm. last year at yeah, this I mean, time, yeah, it was wasn't it that the truck that exploded 
um, I just a couple of days oh, yeah, before I Christmas, remember? I think I remember. And on this year, it was for the justice of Rafilia, the pink cocaine. Mm. I mean, there's so many bad things happening that you just like, yo, yeah. I can't even relax. I have to be so cautious because when is it going to happen to me? Yeah. 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 Like, I remember, I remember going out, um, I said in episode one, I went to and I vended my boys, so it was at some house. And a couple of days later, that justice um, for Rafilia happened. Thing happened. And the thing is, at that event, there were girls there that probably were young, but probably under the influence as well. But we were just there because, you know, I'm just the type of person who's not interested in me. Like, damn, mm. bro. Like, every year, it's like the age to access alcohol reduces. You know Literally. what I'm saying? And, like, we reduce it ourselves. It's not it even is, like it's a... Just, it's not the law that mm. doesn't it's, yeah. it's, like, it's like kids or... Yeah, kids. It's kids, bro. It's yeah, kids. Especially kids, they... yeah. And it's scary because this is happening now. Imagine when we have kids, the access yeah. that they're going to have to alcohol. And it's like, and it's like, it's like, it's like... Like these girls, us as gents, also we're so young and we're doing these things, bro. We are literally gonna be mothers and fathers to people. Mm. Like, what kind of mothers and fathers are we gonna, are we gonna be, be? Yeah. To, if this I, was like our upbringing? Uh, you know? yeah. think, and it's us we raise ourselves. It's not even like we're leaving our parents. Like, like, like your parents will try, and then you just like nah, 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 type of a thing. I don't know. It's like, bro, we're just being raised by the streets. And the, and the, and the, and the sad thing about what you're saying is that, like, now as we are young and we're doing all these things. How are we gonna raise our kids? Mm. Mm. And you'll find that some of them will have to go through a traumatic experience to then realize that you are. I need to change I can't, my way. I, I need to change yeah. my way. And That's now, fine. Yeah. Then there'll be those parents will be like, nothing happened to me, so nothing's gonna happen to my kid. Mm. Yeah. You know, so it's that type of so it really becomes difficult with that. And I'm just saying, like, you know, I don't have a problem with like the whole club culture or whatever the case is, because mm. remember mm. there's responsibility, but and that club culture that, I had it, but that club culture was there before even us. Dog, so you can't blame they, clubs. You can't blame, it's people, you can't, bro. Can't blame clubs. Clubs, clubs were there before they us. Were there before us. Mm. The only problem yeah, is, yeah, yeah. The only problem is that, like, yo, why do these young kids think they're old now? Mm. You understand? Why mm. is it that, like, when you are young, you are focusing on being that? Mm. Now that's what we need to question. Yeah. Why yeah. can't we get young kids trying to be like, yo, I'm young, I'm still in high school, or I'm this? Let's try see how we can enjoy a uh, thing maybe they make money yeah. and all of that but yeah. why does it resort to things that are not supposed no why does it resort to yeah. that i can't have fun with i can have fun without alcohol or drugs i remember i was at the party right mm. and then this guy's like um do you guys have a rizla right um yeah, that thing yeah, used yeah, to rizla, be there yeah. and i'm like nah he's like yo you guys are sober as f i'm like bro <laughs> i don't go to a party or an event to <laughs> to smoke a drink i can i can have fun with that yeah you can, you can have fun with that i mean me and my boys were just like, chilling we're listening to the music mm. and everyone was questioning like ah oh, these guys are sober I'm like, what the heck? i mean bro i don't think a lot of us or youth um can have fun with that being under the influence no. i under think the now that's, uh, that's, that's a problem like right now because now yeah. the thing is like who says club is the only fun bro Exactly. Mm. What happened to those wholesome days of like, yo, James, let's let's do a Golden City, bro. Mm. Or like, you know, like there's no age to mm. that. You yeah. understand? Like, but now it's that thing. Also, when we grow, nah, we don't do Golden City. We don't do the zoo. Nah, we hey, don't another level. You went last year just at the zoo. Yo, nah. me, me, no, zoos? me, I was at the zoo like last year. So, September. We vibe. Yeah. Like the last time, the, I, time I was at the zoo, I was probably with you. Remember back those times? Yeah, bro, I remember. Like, it was the time, zoo. That, that picture, I remember. It was so fun, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Zoos yeah. actually exist. Bro, I even forgot yeah, about the I forgot them. about the zoo. Yeah. The last time I was at the zoo was probably before I was a teenager, bro. Yeah. So, yeah. But it just goes back to say, bro, like we just, I think with there's our still, age. There's and, still ways to have fun with that. Without drugs, those things, right? I was about to yeah. say that. There's yeah, still, like, still other ways. ways. Yeah. We, and like, and even besides drugs, before we even get to drugs, because drugs is extreme, but like ways of having fun, places to have to fun, have, fun yeah. have changed. Yeah. You understand? They've, they've, and now it's now like, it's thing, all right, bro. Like sleepovers now have a whole... Yeah, the yeah, whole sleepover trust, thing. Yeah. How, how, how's it Wait, every gent ever been on a sleepover with like girlfriends? Like nah. fr- like literally female like friends. female friends. Nah, but male friends quite often. I yeah. remember being, my parents were... I was invited. To, to, to the female sleepover? Yeah. Oh, you were invited to a female sleepover? Yeah, this person saw me here. Huh? Remember that story? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. Wait, you got invited to a female sleepover? Nah, nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. no. Like, bro, off, off cam, off cam. Yeah, yeah off cam. Right off cam. Yeah. Bro, has to share but, the like, like, <laughs> this guy has to share the myth, bro. bro. We don't have, we don't have ace. Nah, hell no. What the myth? No, you just chill, bro. Yeah, like just chill. Well, in with his experience, yeah. I guess, yeah. Hey, 
Nah, nah, I've never been to. I've never been to a funeral. But, but, but the thing is that like it's wholesome, bro. Like it's wholesome. Yeah. <laughs> you like you know you go there. It was calm because like I was invited for like a, mm. a birthday, and yeah. then it my intention was not to sleep over. It yeah. just we it just happened to sleep. Oh, over. okay. I see. So it wasn't a thing that like I'm going to a sleepover. I was yeah. just invited for a birthday, and then yeah. we just had to sleep over. Nice but the meal sleepovers. Uh, my parents. I think our relationship. It's based off trust, you know what I'm saying? And I'm really grateful to God for that. Um, yes, there have been times it's like, no, just because of, you know, how it is being a parent. I can't really explain on that. But going to sleepovers, my parents would be like, now you can go. I've always returned back home, communicated. <laughs> yeah. I came back home so bad. I didn't go back home, vomit. Nothing. I was hey, always bro, good, yeah. you know, even that's why I was able to go to this event thing with my friends and come back home at 10 because my parents trust me and I trust myself and know that. I don't, I'm not interested in that. So there's nothing you can do to, to like, you, you yeah, even if you were to, for example, uh, spike my drink, I'm intelligent to know that, bro, I'm not going to leave my drink. I'm not going to order a drink from the bar. I'd rather uh, Uber Eats myself or something like that. Because mm. I know when I'm in these environments, anything can happen. Can happen yeah. So yeah. that's why I'm just grateful I have the trust. But when it comes to sleepovers, yeah, my parents have been blessed. I just ask them, they say, cool, you can <clears> go. But with yeah. females... Like female friends. No, nah, I don't. I don't have. I've never. I wouldn't want to do that. But, but that, that's a red flag. It's about female friends. Yeah, that is a red flag. Even yeah. if I, nah, I, or, I or like, let's say in the context of like guy friends, female friends, but you just all group of friends. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Sleep red off. flag. <laughs> yeah, that you know, is. I'll, I'll still personally say no. Bro. Yeah, as a as a parent, I'll tell like you like no. if if I see these boys and or girls. Or if you're a parent, I think if, if you're a parent, if I'm a say, parent, then, okay, if okay. I see these boys and girls, then they all wanna go sleep. Oh no. Their wait, friends, wait, no. and, and I, I wanna okay, makes sense, nah. yeah. But like, do you guys say no because of you know how guys can be? Yeah, okay, no, both guy and, and if girl, I have a son you know or a daughter, how, you know if how. I have a son or a daughter, yeah, right, and they wanna be in a situation where they sleep over and they are a group of friends and there's boys and girls there, you understand? Like, no, mm. facts, like, no, even if you guys are gonna be good or whatever, no, I don't care if I know the parents, you, yeah, or I know like, it's they. I, be I, responsible. I just allow. Leave my house. You'll do all what you gotta do. But I've, uh, yeah, and maybe it's like unfair. Me, yeah. My fault. You can go. Nah, like for me, I was just gonna say I've never been on a sleepover with fe- like female, female. Me like, too. Only <laughs> family, cousins. Yeah, things yeah. Like yeah. That. Only, that's, that's fine. That's yeah. fine. But friends, like female friends, mm. or male friends, like nah. Maybe male friends is a thing of like yo. I know I'm friends with your friend's father or mm. friend's something, mother. Something. Yeah. Something. Mm. I can go there without you being there. Also, I can chill with. Your okay. friend's father or something. Yeah. You yeah. understand? It's different. Yeah, then that's different. But just in J, nope. Yeah. And then what do you I, think about what happens when our youth or the people generation they end up taking these drugs? How do you feel about the actions that happen after they're under the influence of alcohol and drugs now? I mean, at least so many things. Yeah, at least so many things. I mean, the most Ooh, common that, thing when I ask the question is the justice for a fluid thing yeah. um where apparently the victim was like under the influence, under the influence. i mean from <laughs> a third perspective it's like the same thing of um for example i don't know and I, I don't understand the story i mean i did but now i forgot about it where they went mm. to the clubhouse i mean that's all about trust that the parents has you know at the end of the day they managed to finish but the mm. thing is for me that's the problem is the intention you know what i'm saying mm. you that's that's just the thing from the male's perspective the intention yeah. is really wicked not in a good way, but in a bad way. And the thing about a male perspective is that, bro, we see future. We don't live for now only. Mm-hmm. You understand? And the thing is, like, maybe with fathers also, they will be like, no, you're not going there. Mm-hmm. And probably be like, why? Like, not gonna like, no, you're not going there. You mm-hmm. understand? Whether it happens or not, mm-hmm. I'm not comfortable with you being in a situation like that. Yeah. You might not be, but there's a chance you're gonna be in a situation like that. Mm-hmm. And I don't deal but with chances. I, yeah, you understand? Yeah, and I just think like with this conversation, it's a thing of like, okay, because it, it happened. So mm. like, even us speaking as like, maybe like, let's say speaking from like a parent point of view. Yeah? Mm. Um, let's look at the situation from like third eye. Yeah, I like, look at it. You are not there. So actually we are a third eye. Actually we are. Individually, like us. Yeah. We, we saw it, whatever. And bro, it's like, it obviously everything can be so avoided. 100%. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not going to even speak for anyone or... Or defend, obviously. Yeah, definitely. Anyone, yeah. Or act like I know the people or whatever. But it's like, as as young people, because we're more or less all the same age with the this whole situ- people that are involved in the situation. It's like gents and ladies, bro. Like, 
I'm not I'm not even gonna start saying things like you're too young to be there, bro. We do these things. I'm not gonna even say things like uh young people shouldn't be drinking and smoking, bro. It happens. It happens. That's not gonna change yeah, anything. That, never my change. Change. That, that's, my change. that thing of saying people that thing of saying yeah, but these young kids, bah, no, what are they they're drinking? Yeah. Bro, it's not gonna change it. So unfortunately, yes, keep saying it, but it's not gonna change. I mean, it happened. That's it's, a, it's a problem, but it's the, not gonna change. The stricter, that's the problem. The stricture you become the problem is that the like, more the more smarter the, they become to find out ways to do it behind your back. And but, and but my issue with that is that like there's all these wrong things that you're now accepting that you can't change, and now these wrong things become a norm. It mm. become and now it's a thing, it is what it is. That they're drinking. That they're drinking. Back then, it wasn't like that. I uh, understand. I fair, think it was. It was. I, no. think, I think it maybe was. Maybe it was. But not as much. But, but like, there were repercussions to it. Now it's a thing of like, yo, if if she came back home drunk, she's just going to get a lecture. She will probably still, uh, he or she is still going to get a lecture. He will probably still have his phone. He will probably still go out. He will probably oh, so still go through all those things. from the prince perspective exactly. as discipline. But back then, you know, yo, they will tell you that, yo, I, when I came back, I, I, I was I was worked, I was punished, I was grounded. But right now, it's becoming the norm to a point where by now nah, they're growing. You understand? Mm, Maybe yeah. I guess the way is so, changing. Okay, so you're saying the fear aspect is missing because the fear of getting the whooping, exactly. the fear of getting punished because, will lead you to not do it. So, so that's what I'm saying that that the fear of aspect is gone, and the reason why you shouldn't be doing these things because as Willie was saying is that they're gonna do it anyway. Mm. I have a problem with the fact that it's not gonna change mm. because now. We are accepting that this thing is going to get worse and worse and worse. And you're accepting that it is what it is. Mm. Then it's going to become, it's not going to become a bad thing anymore. It's going to become normal. Yeah. You understand? So that's my issue is that like, we should change it now. Yeah. You understand? And that's why maybe parents, they, they should know that, you know what? I'm not going to live in today's world. Mm. What my parents told me back then when it was with me, I'm still going to apply it with my kid. Whether the world is changing in a different way or whatever, I'm still applying it with my kid. Until my kid does certain things, then you'll change them. Exactly. The thing, the thing, I agree with that. The thing is, the reason why I'm assuming, I don't know, my parents haven't told me this. The reason why I'm assuming my parents have so much trust with me is because they said, okay, Limo is different from, they were my older brother. So we're going to raise them like this because siblings are not the same. Yeah. Children are not the same. So for us to say, before we even have children, us, us as future adults, that I'm going to raise my child like this when that day comes in the future, when he comes across this problem, it may not work because we don't know how they're going to be in terms of their personality and how the resources will be there. We can plan, yeah, sure. Makes sense. We yeah, can that say that sense. now I'm going to be more strict, but I don't think the being more strict will work with them. I think us as children, we learn more when reality hits us, if we're being honest. Now, like, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not speaking for them, but those um, boys who did that thing, I'm sure now reality is hitting because of that's where they are now. This, wherever they are in jail, I'm assuming, the reality is hitting them. Damn, this is my mm. consequence of doing this. Us as children mm. or as human beings, we learn once reality hits us. So, um, but then, do you want your kids to learn in that way, though? As reality, I mean, there's a certain if, okay, way. If, there's if, a certain if, extent where you want your kids to learn reality, bro. I mean, for those parents, um, for example, for the justice of the other boys, I'm sure they're heartbroken, right? I can imagine because their children is in that certain uh, position. But as your morals, bro, as a man, right? We need to see women like Kanye West said women not to conquer but to nurture i don't care how down bad i am but there's certain things that i will never do to a woman so me having those morals i'm gonna have to deal with my son in the position that he is and it's gonna be tough love you know you can love someone from a distance and in the position where he's at i'm gonna love him from there knowing that <laughs> he's gonna learn the way he is. <laughs> I, I like i like how he's, he's not changing to like a parent perspective low key. yeah yeah yeah, uh, but it's James. Me, I hear you, James. So, are, we, are you guys saying like? Because me, 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 me are saying let's yeah. look at it from third person, but you guys are looking at it from parents. Parents. You guys are looking at it from like let's fix it. Ne, mm. that's the thing, mm. bro. And me, let's be realistic, bro. I, I, Problems are only gonna get worse. That's true. Like if we can, if we can, um, like. Except that, unfortunately, bro, that's the, the, the most painful pill to yeah. swallow. Problems are going to get worse. There's nothing that's going to get better, bro. Nothing's going to get better. I think, I think, Let's I think, accept it, man. I think you choose to say that it's not going to get worse for you, bro. For the world, yeah. But like you... Nah. But, but, you, dog, you, can't, you, but you can't... Okay. But my chat is that you cannot accept that problem if you know what's going to Nah, I'm accepting the fact that problems are going to get worse. 
generally okay, not right. the problem ah, okay, there's yeah, no yeah, yeah. that I like that's it. that's something you need to accept <clears throat> that's that's why there's things called adapting bro we adapt oh. you can speak to your child that's you adapting to that there's this problem that exists so how are we gonna work around it yeah. not this thing of forcefully we're gonna stop it it's mm. not gonna stop like this Trust the, me, this this debate that i was listening to my yeah. fault no 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 sorry, my fault the other day saying do you guys think your parents will survive if they were reborn in this generation and a lot of people said no Cause it's not the same, bro. I don't think that. There's the charity, internet. There's nah, social but, but, media. But, but they say and things my like, charity is that there are kids out there who, or or, or people our age who are living in the same way mm. that our parents were living, and they're still fine, bro. I'm telling you, yeah, you'll find that there are people where you like, it's, bro, yeah. dog, you really don't go out. Like, yeah, I don't, mm. because it was instilled from the parents from the get go. Yeah, would say like our values in this house. Mm. Is that we don't do these things. Mm. Not to say they are wrong or bad, but that's just our value. Mm. Mm. We find something else. Only when you leave this house, you do whatever you want to do. And you know how where like parents yeah. that have those children, they say you are blessed. Because uh, I was listening to the radio the other day and they mentioned how, I don't know if it was a lady. I don't want to be too sure because uh, it it's a vivid memory. She was saying, you know, I'm blessed that my child, he listens to me. I think... Nowadays, we're reaching the, t- the exactly, time where bro. where if you have a child that listens to you and doesn't do this, you it's blessed. a blessing, bro. And, 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 and that's I'm, th- I'm thinking. I don't know if that's pretty Okay, James. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> huh? James, scary, wait. Huh? That's let's, scary. I agree. Let's, 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 not. let's be a little bit real. Like, no, no, no. no I'm not going to use the realistic. You know, you remind me. We're kids. You remind me, you remind me we are young here. Remind me of myself. Okay, I'm, we're not kids. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're young. Kids, yeah. We're young. We're not kids. Like, let's be, we're not kids. We're young. Yeah. 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 There are young people watching us who are older than us, a little younger, same age. Bro, are we... Have you been that perfect child? Don't don't look at it from your parents' eyes yourself. No, I haven't been that perfect child. Okay, you? Um, I'd be lying to you if I said yes. So you, I'm saying I'm not the perfect child. Okay, so James, let's look at it like that, that. bro. Because I, I can because say, no, I'm not the perfect child. But at least I can say my parents trust me. You see, yeah. Exactly. yeah. That's so that that's what, like, the yeah, that's what I'm adding that fact. Yeah, that like, I let's, get what bro, let's. We're not here, gents. So we can't address people like us, us watching here. Yeah, yeah. We're not being realistic to an extent. Yeah, being real with you, gents, as well. You understand. Mm. So especially with this kind of situation, bro, because we understand that like the parties are not gonna go anywhere. We mm. can't say kids cannot go to parties. Yo, I'll take my kids to a party. But my issue is that we cannot accept the fact that we have kids. Who are now drinking when it's wrong now we've been like yo it is what it is no yeah. so the only thing we need to change is just talking to the kids directly we're dealing exactly. with it and their mindset yeah. not change uh, but try to inspire. i don't want to say we know parties exist they're not going to change they're, they're not going to go change. adapt to the fact that they're not going to change don't try don't try yeah. don't try like bruh. I don't like, know what I don't know what the word is like, to use. The Listen, is, yeah. they're gonna be there. Alcohol's gonna be there. It's gonna Kids, be there true. It's not gonna go. So adapt to working around that, bro. Yeah. yeah. Don't understand. don't try like change it. You're not gonna change it. Yeah, we can't change it. So now yeah. the advice that you give maybe to your peers is that like my fit. You can see you see these drugs, this alcohol. Yeah. We all don't qualify to drink. Let's just listen to music and dance. That's it. Done. Facts. Instead of accepting the fact that we would see, ah, James, we want to still and, drink. And if your friend, and if exactly. your friend or that person you're with can't um, deal with that, then bro, then you pick what you wanna do. With yeah, that you friend, you pick what you wanna yeah. do. Because at the end of the day, like what Omelemo said, is that like maturity, trust doesn't just come with everything. We like we will see even with your friends, we'll be like, I'm at this friend, I don't trust him. Mm. You understand? But him, mm. I trust him. I can go out to groove with him. Yeah. But with this friend, I don't trust because why? Because he's gonna want to drink, he's gonna exactly. want to smoke drugs, yeah. he's gonna want to do this. Because yeah. like the company friend, you keep, oh, bro. exactly. Yeah, you understand. Yeah, yeah. So it's that type of a thing that like we shouldn't allow these things of like when people do it and say that they are gonna do it anyway. They yeah. are gonna do it anyway. But let's not put it as it is what it is. It's wrong. Point, point blank. It's wrong yeah. to do drugs when you're 18 mm. or to drink. Wait, it's wrong. Wait, wait. Don't say good now. It's that new reality and now we must adapt to it. And no. 15, 16, you drink alcohol, you are wrong. Point blank. Done. Mm. You understand? So, yeah. Um, okay, I think, yeah. I, I heard it. Yeah. Mm. Okay. yeah I, I, because I, whether well, uh, they're going to do it, but that doesn't make okay, them so, right. Okay, okay, okay. How, 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 do how, 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 advise? how, yeah. advise. how do we advise yeah. them? Because now we know saying it's wrong is not enough, obviously. Yeah, because saying obviously. it's wrong is not enough. Not so now enough. my issue is that like, 
to your peers or to your friends, you'll be like, hey, dog, uh, me, if, whenever I go out with you, it's your business at the end of the day. Because to a certain extent, bro, you can't control people. You can tell them what is wrong. They will still do whatever they want to do. It's, mm. it's not in your hands anymore. You understand? Mm. You told them, Guti, dog, it's wrong. I feel like that advice is enough, bro. For now, you trying to take the drink out of their hand. If you know that they're not at a good state, then you're like, okay, no, let me just take the drink out of their hand. I see this person is not here, you know? But now, if you can see Guti he makes that conscious decision to do it, what can you do? You gave your advice and you're done. Mm. You understand? And that's what that's what we should do. Mm. Kids, okay. need, kids need also, to be strong. So you so you saying that your measure of like assisting in terms of adapting or even trying to stop this whole thing from continuing is to advise to say that it's wrong. Like that's the actual action. Yeah. To advise, like to advise. stop. Stop. And then if they make the conscious decision that now nah, I'm gonna continue, then obviously yeah, it's out of your hands. Okay. It's out of your hands. Yeah. 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 I, I agree. And like honestly, that's the most you make can do, bro. Because mm. I'm not gonna because take... I'm not gonna be like ah, Okay, then yeah, that makes sense. You I guess, understand? Yeah. But like let's stop accepting the fact that these 15 year olds who are drinking, it's illegal. What it's illegal. What, it's what illegal. consequences illegal. are they facing? No, they're not doing anything about it. Facts. You understand? They're not yeah, they still I... go back home, they wake up, there's no consequences because we're just leaving them. And that's the reality. It's going to get worse. You understand? Mm. Because we're not, we're not teaching them and saying, yo, you're grounded for this or this. Bro, cops will leave these kids, bruh. This whole justice thing, right? Of like just trying to make it seem as if how wrong these gents were. Because they are wrong. But teach the girls also, Guti. Look what she did as well. Mm. That you should avoid doing. Mm. And I don't see that happening. And now, we're still letting girls go according because they'd be like, nah. She did it like you understand. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if I'm making and, sense. And but I, you know, but I, I, maybe maybe the home that the homes that people come from are the reason for because we'll st- because my from. my issue is that some people yeah my the the, the while well, in this situation girls are still gonna do what she did and they They're will gonna, learn and and, and and it's still gonna be the same like low key young people yeah exactly. that's why there's there's always but, two sides to the story yeah there's always and, two sides yeah and let's be honest society always um. Favors the girl. Favors the girl. I'm just going to say point blank. I mean, okay, if you're putting, if you're putting it in the situation I spoke about before, I mean, we can say it. Because what the guys did at the end of the day, it's wrong. It's wrong. It's wrong. It's wrong. But let's not close our eyes. The, the female's perspective is wrong. I mean, you're 15 mm. and you're drinking alcohol. Girls, alcohol. learn from this. I mean, learn. I, and I'm not saying it like, what are you doing? Yeah. Or I'm not saying Because it you to, know 15-year-olds drink. Yeah, yeah I'm, so I'm not that, saying that it like it's child, something I haven't like, seen before. I know it's happening, yeah. but you need to know. I mean, I saw this um, reel on Instagram yesterday saying I'm a girl that lives in South, South, South Africa and I bring pepper spray. I wanted to be I'm a girl in South Africa, and if I if I want to go to Groove, I'm I'm not gonna drink alcohol. I'm gonna limit my alcohol mm. if you're below eighteen. If mm. you if you're above eighteen, you make your Whatever. decision. Yeah. Even if you're below eighteen, it's still insane. Yeah, it's still I mean. insane. Yeah. Yeah. But because I see, I see. Yeah. I mean, I really, I'm, I'm really. Um, shout out to the girls, you know, for standing up. But I think it's gonna continue if both parties exactly. don't play a role, bro. Teach, both parties teach the girls also, Guti. Girls, look, when you're fifteen, don't do these things. Yeah, mm. they're not doing that, bro. And they they are not doing that, and mm. and with the guys as well, it's exactly. like, bro, you now, need to you need mm. to stop as well. You need to you need to lock in. As I said earlier, North Kanye. Because us as guys, all we know is that yo, if a girl's drunk, just stay away. That's what we learn now. Mm. Is that if a girl's because, drunk, yeah, just stay yeah, away. Yeah, Far. Yeah, that's what Far. it is. Don't even talk to her. Don't even because ah, uh, one minute she's with another crew, but one minute ago you were talking to her, so you involved. That's you understand? True. So that's what we learn. But like, what are you teaching the girls now? Yeah. Because mm-hmm. you understand? Yeah. Yeah. That's hey, bro. Hey. Earlier, earlier on, I did mention and that. It, yeah. Yeah, um, you see? When I, when I went to with my friends and then the justice for everything happened a days after, we made a joke and we were like, lads, what if um the people were talking to, what if something bad happened to them? You know what I'm saying? It's how um like, now where like a third party yeah, thing, yeah you know now as gents we need to realize that bro if if she's drunk if she's under the influence we have to be careful now mm. we have to mature we can't even, we can't even and sit next to her now yeah. I mean not not and say, it's not that thing of like it's that thing of like not saying because it's like half out as well yeah also because us um 
it brings trouble. I mean, even for guys, for girls as well. Yeah. If you're talking to a guy that's drunk, it's gonna bring problems. It's, gonna bring yeah. problems. it's potentially gonna bring problems yeah. for for a guy as well. If you're talking to a girl that's drunk, it's potentially gonna bring problems. I also think we should stop looking at it as a thing of boys and girls and just humans in general that we're both we both um struggling with the same thing. Yeah, we should dealt with that. the same way. No, no gender should receive a bit. Uh, words of kindness because of the gender you fall in. Yeah. You're both. We're both wrong at the end of yeah, the day. Yeah, we both. Right, and it's just a thing of like I don't. We don't know how to con- like these people who drink, and then this drinking leads to these, um, like these events yeah, happening. Exactly. The binge drinking. That bro, they they don't know how to drink. They they binge. Drink. They they don't drink to enjoy it like yeah. the way alcohol is supposed to, to be. Enjoy. It's a thing of like, and I'm not saying I don't drink alcohol. Like, and the thing is bro, that alcohol I don't drink, but it's a thing. Well, yeah, it's a thing of like people now, especially these young people. They don't drink alcohol the way it's supposed to be drank. They drink it to be sloshed, like finished. You're not supposed to. Slow. From my knowledge, bro, my mom says this. You're not supposed to drink alcohol till you can't walk. That's, that's stupid, bro. And uh, like whether that's you're young dumb. or old, you shouldn't be drinking alcohol at like, that point. Yes, you can't live and say, I can't wait tomorrow so I can get drunk till I'm dead. Mm. Like, till I drop. That's stupid. Or, or I want to get lit. Like, that's stupid. Oh, I'm I sorry. Get lit. I want to get like, lit. You can, no, you can get lit, man. Nah. But nah. But, yeah, you can get lit. No, the thing, the, is, no, 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 the thing is, is, I agree, nah. But when people say, I want to use lead, they're not using it the way we're using it. The way we're using it. They're using it. I want to get get finished. finished. That's the thing, bro. And I don't think, I think that's why they put an age age limit to alcohol, like 18, 21, whatever it is. Because they know after this age, bro, you should be like, you should have that, the mature Mature enough to know that, bro, I'm having like four glasses, five glasses, and I'm going to get that niceness that I want. Exactly. Like, Like, not this thing of like, I'm drinking... Until I can't drink anymore, bro. No, you that's see? not. I don't think that's how it's supposed to be, bro. And yeah. the thing is, so, that people will measure like, okay, this guy drank a beer and he's still fine, and then you think you will be fine after that. Yeah, yeah, we're, we, not, we're not the same. We're different, bro. You, are, you understand? Mm. Now it's that whole comparison thing, and mm. like, yo, we are not the same. Mm. And like, yeah, I think, I think now that I was speaking about it, it's these things that leads to like these, these unspeakable, unspeakable events unspeakable happening, events. and it's just becoming younger and younger yeah. and younger and younger. Yeah. And younger. It just gets worse, bro. Mm. I mean, yeah, for me, yeah. Um, I honestly don't think I can say any, I can add any input to the current conversation because y'all said what I wanted to say. Just to sum it off, uh, to move on to the next thing we want to discuss. Yeah. Guys, you need to realize that it's you versus you at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? You got to make those decisions. It's your future. It's your hands. You know what I'm saying? Respectfully, this may sound daunting, but mom and dad, they're not going to be here forever. You know what I'm no, saying? Fine. You're going to have to be an adult one day. And you don't want to see yourself living in a situation where um, it's life is tough behind bars or doing stuff like that. I'm talking to the boys and to the girls. Mm. I'm not just choosing one specific gender. We're living with mm. trauma and stuff. You know what I'm mm. saying? Know what's right and what's wrong. And not because of your feelings. No, because of law. You understand? Don't say, no, drinking alcohol is wrong because you you feel like it's wrong. No, it's wrong because if you're below 18, it's wrong. It's wrong. You facts. understand? Don't mm. say you feel. Mm. No. So... That's what do you I'm, feel? Oh, what do you feel? These these kids. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. And guys, I'm not. What do you feel? So, what do you, what do you feel? feel? It's like yeah, nah, nah. But that's I'm old what enough. I do. But like that's, that's what true. I'm saying is that like, like, be safe. Number one. Facts. You understand? Protect yourself. And I would advise you that like, do these things with people you trust. And trust is not like yo one day or whatever. People who you know, even if you are sloshed. They will help. Like you know. Yeah. You understand. Even if and we're not saying one of us wanna say yeah, we're not saying get sloshed. Yeah, we're not saying get sloshed, but yeah. if you get to that point, yeah. Yeah. they will help you. You yeah. have someone right? to trust. You yeah. have someone to trust who will help you, who will make sure you're safe. Mm. You understand? So and this is for both boys and girls. Mm. Yeah. Understand? And it's unfortunate that it's unfortunate that our our advice has to come out as God forbid, God forbid, because we just know it's happening. Yeah, so, so yeah. just like, that's just, you know, that's the yeah. same thing. Yeah. Yeah. And gents, like, just for me, like, if, if you're, if a girl says no, bro, it's a no. If you met her on the day, if it's your girlfriend, bro, maybe, no matter if, even if, is, even if it's no your wife, is, yeah. anytime you're about to insert, anytime you're about to have sexual intercourse, ask. Yeah. I always say this, like, ask. Doesn't matter how long you've known the person for, boy. Cause you don't want to put yourself uh someone was there half alive or whatever exactly. you did things now it's rape when you wake up bro and if the answer is no no and even if you know the person ask 
Yeah. There's no app where it's been, she's been my girl for three years, but ask. And if she says no, please have the harmonious to, to say the to no. Put your ego and move on. Like get rid of the pride. Get rid of the pride, Jess. Because I feel like sometimes I says gentle, we ex- we yeah, we expect the and, yes. and another one thing I know is a no, Jens. Law, not feelings, law. If she says yes and she's 16 or 15 and you're 17 and you are no. on age of consent and she's not, no. No. Even no. if she says yes. You're going to get locked no. down. No. <laughs> locked no. down, bro. And just, no. I get these things we call cases. You, yeah. you, you, you just have like the, these TikToks that are like, you know, now schools are about to open. Have you yeah. seen these TikToks where they're like, my Matrix. tricks mustn't go for grade eight. Because yeah. yeah. it happens. It happens. Like, it, the, the, it's the, like that. grade bro. eight. Go for my tricks. It's like, bro, come on, come, come on, come on, yeah. come on, come on, come on. You were born in 2010. These these credits are born in 2010. <laughs> yeah. Come on, yeah. <laughs> come on. It's not a 2000. Anymore. It's not a 2000 right. anymore. What are you doing, bro? You understand? Ish. Like what? Like yeah, hey, bro. Yeah. But anyways, yeah, bro. Yeah. I just want I just want to shine yeah. lights on the story of uh, I don't know. I want to make sure I pronounce her name correctly. Machaka Rodebe. Um, Machaka. Yeah. Debe, um, right. it happened on the third of December. Um, the story, in my opinion, it died on too. Um, not died on too early. I mean, didn't get a lot of noise man i just it mm. happened i heard about it early december i'm not gonna lie i don't even know what happened what, 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 um so basically um this girl by the way she's a really good in class had a bad food ahead of her yeah and please correct me if i'm wrong in the comment sections and um one night she was sleeping and in her room and around at 12 p.m she i don't know what happened but then basically her brother woke up and she wasn't in the room anymore in the house and then brother calls her and he gets a call from her phone and on the phone he hears that hey with the money this amount of money for her and he hears this at his age you know what i'm saying and oh, then, how old was he i'm not too sure but oh. i know he's the younger brother oh, okay, okay. so um a couple of days go by and then unfortunately the police found her dead so for me it's just a thing of bro even in the comfort of your home you're still not safe mm. now to fact she was sleeping at home she didn't do anything wrong she was in her own private place, but still, these things happen, bro. We live in an environment where these things can possibly happen to you, can happen to us. So the reason I'm sh- I'm shedding light on those stories because, in my opinion, it died down too early. It didn't get a lot of um, attention, in my opinion, compared to this story. And yeah, I just wanna, if the brothers watching this, man, I just hope for your future, for the family as well, that God may shower blessings upon you, um, give you the strength to overcome this sudden you know tragedy man it's really unfortunate you don't deserve it man it really touched my heart if i'm being honest so yeah that's why i just want to quickly shine some light on it mm. but that's pretty much it yeah not um yeah man so rest in peace bro you know because yeah, yeah, so the safety of women in this country is another so, hey bro really safety true. of women in this country is another is another it's thing just, bro. Yeah, i didn't go too much into detail because i did yeah. forget but i did brush off i think the important parts yeah but then just you know going back to like what we're speaking about about this thing of like grade eight grade four, which is, which is, yeah, like, that whole thing it goes back down so i wanted to speak about it like girls dating older men and boys yeah. and like older guys going for younger yeah. women yeah. and vice versa, oh, vice versa. Vice versa. Either, yeah. like um that girl what's her name she was on she was on that podcast of spreading humor i mm-hmm. forgot about bubble and she was dating what was it Buster oh Rimes? yeah yeah, yeah. But, bro and what, when she yeah, was Buster. 15 she was dating him when he was 30. 30. that's insane bro dog look look that, that's a case that is dog. for me that's that's nasty, nasty, bro. Bro. that's really yeah. like, she's, she's, not, she's public, not even bro. like consent she's not even 18. it's even in the public and still and still nothing i think and i think if i remember correctly her her, ex- her, not her excuse, but her reason. They asked her why. She was like, it was just a thing at the time. Uh, bro, no. Nah, Come bro. on. Come and, on. And these are things that we're avoiding because now we are in a situation where like, yo, bruh, boys and girls cannot date each other because they're not in the same age. Mm. It's, it's, it goes back to all, that whole transaction thing. Mm. Like, uh, I want a man who's this. And you know what I, it is, man? I want a woman. There's this thing, this nature, like, I guess it's like nature, bro. Like, it's, there's just this thing. It's like, it's kind of cool. Maybe if you're, if you're a girl and you're dating a guy that's like three years older than you. It's like, it's that thing. Yeah. yeah. But in the world we live in now, it's like, they, they've, oh, they, they've like, I they've mean, normal, not they, they've normalized it. They've used that, yeah. that thing. And, exp- and, and, the and expanded it. And to, to crazy. like, yeah, I mean, think bro. about with our parents as well. Um, if you can compare the age, some relationships, there's quite, there's a gap in terms of age, right? Yeah. But at least that happened when they had bro, a consent. Bro, exactly. Consent is bro. the most important. Like, like there's Basta, nothing wrong. bro, you could have waited. I mean, just 15, bro, like, like, you could have waited, waited, like, yeah. respectfully. Mm. I mean, if you found it that attractive, you could have waited. But the thing is, uh, 
it's just it's so nasty. <laughs> even say, even yeah. saying finding out attractive exactly, is insane. Bro, because, like, yeah, because you know what it is as well. Good, yeah, because you know what it is as well. That's like true. sometimes I, I'm, I'm not speaking for every woman or for every woman who's 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 saying what I'm about to say is like an excuse. But like some of them say this. Nah. They say, okay, so why did you go for this guy who's 10, 15 years, 20 years older than you? They're like, no, they knew I was going to boost my career because his name I was going to put out there and things like that. So they know it's wrong, but they're doing it for the bag. Exactly. Nah? Exactly. Yeah. That, this is what they do. Because I mean, now, now it's not, it's like the mindset of the youth. Now. Exactly. They make it a norm for that. Like, yo, hey, if bro. you feel doing something wrong will get you up there, it's cool. Mm. That's that's what's happening that, that, right yeah, now. I mean, facts, facts, life, that's life, what's facts. happening right now. Life yeah. is so tough right now. Yeah. If you can date the right person, you can make it a career. If you think about it, yeah. yeah. And that's how sad it is. That yeah. life is so tough that I go yeah. into like it's, it's almost a thing of like I did, I did, I, I, it's like that thing where they say I did bad things for for a good reason. A good reason. Like I did bad, bad for good for, for the for good. Yeah. And then, bro, like ah, and they glorify and they're like ah, yeah. bro, do what you have to do. And it's like yeah, and it's like words like that. Yeah, that 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 you normalizing this thing do what you have to do it is what it is yeah. and you're like ah, bro but you know Uzi, this is wrong mm. you understand now we're losing the whole value of what a relationship should be and then you hear things like this and it worked for her it works for these the other females who've been through this Uti. you know but then another female's like oh it worked for this lady that i look up to maybe let me try let me look, look for older man mm. look for the older man with exactly. wrong intentions next thing you're exactly. dead and and these and these and you'll find most of them are like ig famous and all of that. These obviously things. these girls here they looking up to, up to them. them. They're bro. not gonna look up to a girl's dating ah, a guy. And you know what I just age. thought of? It creates this thing in women's minds that like I need a man subconsciously, subconsciously, subconsciously. Because you're hearing the person that you. And I'm not speaking for a woman, but you're like, yeah, I need a man and a partner. Yeah, 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 yeah you, you're listening to. I'm, I'm gonna just say it. Um, what, 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 what's her name? Babalo mm. saying, yeah, this, 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 and like that kind of helped her career. Yeah, someone's gonna look up to her and want to be a dancer and TikTok famous as well, and look for these things. And in case this thing in women's minds, like, yo, I need that man with that bag to get me there. Right. Exactly. And you'd find. Right. And on the way there, you you, you find these other cases. And the you're thing, you rape. You see what you, you see? see. And then you uh, think it was gonna go. Maybe her. She was lucky. That nothing happened. And that to happened to her. And then you, yeah. and and that's what they advocate. Yeah. They're like, nah, dog. Like, if you wanna get to a certain point, right, or you wanna get yourself a man who has money, mm. do it, girl. Do it. Go for <laughs> it. Go for it. You understand? <laughs> so Survive. sometimes I feel like you know, yeah. when when it comes in a case like that, it could be survival. I think love is maybe when you are on a mature, like if you are about mm. eighteen or yeah. something, yeah. you then understand what love is. Yes. Yeah, basically, hundred percent. Like when you understand what it is, then you know it's okay. It's love. It's yeah. love. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't think it's yeah. I don't. But um, for most for most situations, it's definitely not love. Mm. It's just survival. As I said earlier yeah. on, dating the right person can end up being a career if you find the right You're person. Fine. But we also need to touch on the fact of like how these old men accept this, bro. Mm. Like, I mean. They, I don't, I don't know, Buster. I've never met this guy in my life, but I'm assuming, a, lust, b, and pride. Yeah, yeah, true. Because if you think about it from that, bro, you have to be so lust has to have so much grip on you that you even ignore the age. That yeah. you, that's how much lust has a grip on you. Mm. And then the pride of oh, I can get away with it. I'm Buster Rhymes. Think about mm. it. Everyone knows, but where is he at? Mm. Bro, still walking free. You know what I'm mm, saying? Yeah. So it's all of that thing of, bro, uh, bro um, men that have money and not at the right state of being have too much power. Know, sometimes. Too much power. We're not speaking, too much power. we're not saying all of them, but we're, we're not just saying, saying, we're just saying yeah. some of them, bro. Yeah. saying some of them because men will be, because men also have this thing of like, when I have money, I can get any girl. And even when I get That's it, she's going to give me what I want That's because true. why I'm giving her money. She That's can't true. say no because mm. I'm giving her money. That's if true. I'm giving her 50K, she can't say no if I want to sleep with her. Mm. Yeah. It goes to that and situation. Is that? that is pride. Exactly. That yeah. is pride. That's true. You know? Yeah. And true. this is what young girls go through. Mm. Because mm. they're like, I want a guy with older money. Then you get a guy who's going to give you 200K. We're sleeping. No, I don't want to. I, want, hmm, I give you money. We're doing you this see? Thing. You see? 
you now you're in a situation that's then what yeah, and then now then now leads to those things where you were kept succumbing to this succumbing to this you were being raped 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 the whole time and then only when you're 40 years old and now you are someone you come out and say you're being raped, raped by this guy by this guy back then but back then you couldn't but back then you couldn't say it couldn't bro, say i mean that's one thing i don't like that some women have done yeah they yeah. come out later, later. Oh, they say he raped me 20 years ago bro, oh sure. <laughs> you said buster rise <laughs> It's Buster Rhymes. It's not. It's Buster Nine to Nine. It's Nine to Nine. Oh, what you were saying? I said Buster Rhymes. Yo, yeah. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Buster Nine to Nine. Buster Nine to Nine. Buster Nine to Nine. I mean, yeah. damn. Bangs yeah. Yeah. Shout out to Bangs. Nah, but damn. But yeah, you're so saying. Yeah, I was just saying, um, like, yeah, I was just like, you need to know what you're talking about. Damn. Yeah, yeah, bro, because I was a bit confused. Yeah, but like, anyways, um, yeah. it just goes back to that thing of like now, women coming back twenty years later, thirty years later, saying I was raped thirty years ago. Mm. Listen, another thing with i'm sorry yeah, but come on could. i'm i'm kind of like come on you like, know um that it's what's it's the name it though. doesn't like because now bro, not, you would find and maybe that's the same thing happening with jump jump and amada dupont but that yeah yeah, yeah that one we don't know but, but it's, it's, it's the same thing, same thing. The thing is that it's like some thing. ladies will or or okay let me not put it like ladies per se but like some of them will just do it because they see you coming up mm, okay like yeah they see you good yeah. you coming up it's like yeah. nah and like and i and i guess it's a thing of like um this man used to and like la- um, ladies watching and things we're not like condoning and we're not speaking for exactly, victims yeah. who've been under this yes. or people you understand oh, yeah. i'm just speaking from it as a thing of speak when it's happening mm. you understand speak when it's happening bro don't wait why are you waiting 30 years and i know rape is a traumatic experience it's, very, yeah. it's not easy, to, it's speak not easy to speak about i know yeah. that for a fact but it's like especially if the girl knows you know she was also wrong yeah yeah, yeah 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 exactly i understand but it's like yo bro please speak when speak. it's happening because sometimes it's also hard it's it's not easy to believe if you're telling me you got raped 30 40 years ago mm. ah come 30, on 30 40 years i mean there's not for me it's only quite, it's yeah, only, it's only kind of knowing when it happens and it ruins um the relationship no not relationship the man's career mm. or the woman's yeah. career or the woman's the career can happen can happen yeah. both yeah. Yeah. i mean yeah. with mendy i think he's played for manchester united city sorry bro got um those allegations the allegations were false look at him now he plays for a dead football yeah, club look. because of her look. yeah he she ruined his career but she's okay she walks freely and that's that the part now. where and he, now yeah. his career has changed forever yeah. i mean no football club is going to sign him with that i mean you know reputation yeah. even though he was it was false the allegations yeah. were false and that's why i mean it's crazy to and that's me, why bro. i even talk about guys who see guys don't have this also mentality of like you want to get the bag and then look for a girl like me personally don't look for a girl if she's there and you're down good hmm. if she's there and you're up good but like don't have that mentality of like the money is the one that's gonna bring you that girl because do you trust that that girl's gonna be of value? Do you trust that that girl loves you for who you are? Because mm, yeah. at a certain extent, you will now be blaming the girl of Mandy. But what if Mandy was just that guy who's like, yo, mm. I don't value girls like that. She just came for my money. So like, there's nothing more I should look for. Yeah. You understand? Mm. They don't look for proper qualities of a woman, of a girl. Because now they just have money. They feel like, you know, I can just get any girl I want. Mm. So guys will be in that situation. Yeah. If you neglect stuff like that. Mm. You understand? Mm. Uh, if, you, if you're hearing mm. us right now, and it sounds like we're bashing agenda. You're not listening. Yeah, facts. Yeah. You're not, bro. You're not listening. You're not. Yeah, you're not. Because we're not bashing anyone. I may have said something right now that's not true, but I swear that I'm not bashing anyone. I don't have um, anger towards a certain gender. So it's an it's we're, we're just sharing our we're opinions. just speaking. If you're if you're a girl and you're listening, like ah, oh, I feel like I got bashed. We're not bashing you. No, yeah, yeah. Now, nah, yeah, bashing. listen, if you're a victim of anything we've spoke about yeah. thus far, we're not bashing you. And you feel like we've done an injustice in terms we're of speaking. Not, we're not bashing. We're not bashing you. Um, we're just simply speaking about it from a third yeah. perspective. Yeah. And yeah. of how... Did your neck crack? My bad. Yeah. Ain't no way. <laughs> <That's, laughs> oh, my yeah. God. Like, you, can, you can do that. Yeah. That's no. crazy. Okay, anyway, my fault. No, nah, I can't. I mean... Know. I don't know <laughs> I think it needs to no both parties, yeah. Both parties need to play a role. Yeah. I mean, we spoke about yeah. it from the for justice for, for a few years. Yeah. The the guys in the wrong as well. Mm. Unfortunately, the girl has to do a little bit of homework as well. Mm. Um outside of drinking as well. Below 18, both genders need to do homework as well. And at the end of it, we said we said our fair share. We really said no. Um Lucidia said have someone you trust, and I said it's you versus. All of us you. said no. 
we all said no. We all said no. Yeah, no is no. No, 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 is, no. I mean, yeah, so, bro, mm. you got to lock in, bro. Mm. That's my shirt, so, bro. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, man, that was a W episode yeah, in the man. chat. You know what I'm saying? saying? Spam Ws in the comments, bro. Oh, I don't, don't know. I said to, chat like I'm don't, streaming. Don't, don't, don't forget to tap into the comment section. Hmm. And don't forget, bro, this is just an opinion-based, um, you know what I'm saying, podcast yeah. conversation. So, please, don't forget... To like and comment, share and subscribe. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Watch this with your your, your friends and your family, yeah. bro. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, and like pause it and have discussions within yourselves and like continue. Like just enjoy. Like, that's what this is. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But well, we appreciate the support. And yeah, you know, catch um, us on the next one. Next yeah. week, second week of Thursday. Second yeah. week on the Thursday. Every every, every second, second Thursday. Week. Every second week of Thursday. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. Yeah. <laughs>